<sighs> I'm getting my new mic today. I'm so excited. I wish it would have come earlier, that way I can use it for this video, but it didn't. On my next video, you're gonna hear, hopefully, my audio is just like on point and crisp. It better be because this mic was a little pressy, so I <laughs> can't wait. All right, guys, let's start. Hello, friends, and welcome, welcome back. All right, so today I'm going to just share with you guys an advice that I feel like every girl every woman needs to have i feel um nobody really gave me this advice i had to figure it out on my own and if i would have known this like sooner man it would have just been very very helpful just saying <laughs> um so yes today i'm going to share with you guys how i organize my purse and things are inside my purse and why i have things in my purse and why i don't have certain things in my purse and everything that has to do with my purse okay um so i love small purses i have tried to use like those big purses where you could just fit everything in there like food everything bottles everything i have tried big purses before and they just don't work like for me they just don't it's just too baggy i am like an on-the-go mom so i need something that i could just throw on it's not that heavy um i can take it anywhere that i am that i that i go whether if it's to the store or if it's like to church or to like a nice event i love my purses to be small compact um i only have things there that i need and that i'm just good like on the go and they're not too heavy so i've like i said i've tried big purses right where you just throw everything in there like receipts books bottles everything and it's just annoying because you don't want to carry that one i don't want to carry that one going into the store with like my one and a half year old going grocery shopping like i don't want to have stuff in there that i don't need that's like holding me down i've also tried like itty bitty purses for like i only fit my wallet in there and that has been a struggle because then i feel like i need things that are not in my purse that i should be having so i'm just like okay how do i figure this out how, what do i do <laughs> and this is what i came up with okay so obviously in my purse this one that i have right now i love it this is from target i think it costs like 20 bucks but like backpacks are pretty in right now let me just close it I can show you the right way. So backpacks are pretty in right now. And this is like perfect for me because like it's not in the way. It's not in the front. I have it in the back. My hands are free. You know, even just like a swing bag, I feel like it keeps swinging forward and I have to like keep pushing it back, keep pushing it back. So this is perfect for me. <laughs> and the size is perfect. So obviously you should always have your wallet. This is my wallet in here. I only have my essentials. I cannot do a huge big wallet. Like, you know, like have you seen like those people with like a huge wallet? It looks like a purse. You know, I can't. This is perfect for me right here perfect perfect um what else and this is what i want to talk to you guys about this is where we're gonna park a little bit all right i have this little pouch okay look how small it is okay i got this it's an ipsy little pouch when i had like the ipsy um subscription i don't anymore um but um i kept this um from them because i love this little pouch this fits in all of like my purses that are perfect for me that they're not super small they're not even medium they're like in between small and medium Okay, that's what this is. It's 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 not super small, but it's not medium. It's like in between. Anyways, um, so in here I have a whole bunch of little stuff that I think are super helpful um, as a mom on the go when you're like, man, I really wish I needed this, even for like odd situations. Um, but I make sure that this little pouch fits in the purses that I would use every single day. That way, um, whenever I'm switching purses, all I have to do is just grab these two things. I go whoop throw them in there i'm good to go so man i wish that this was taught or like you know i knew about this a while ago so anyway so in here i'm going to show you what i have and these are my essentials these are things that i need um i could need every day or just things that you would need in certain situations um that may arise i want to be prepared okay so again all the things that i'm going to talk to you i'm going to share with you um fit in this little pouch okay just to make life easier for us all right so let's see <laughs> So I'm into makeup, obviously. Um, so what I have in here, because there could be makeup emergencies, guys. I have a brush, okay, and a. Um, this was a sample from Sephora that my sister gave me. It's not my exact shade, but it's close to it. It's a powder. If I can open it, here we go. So it's a powder, okay. So whenever, say, I'm like somewhere and I'm like, man, my face is getting, you know, kind of oily, or I need to just like powder up. Here it is. I just and I just powder up perfect right and it fits in my pouch so this could be like one emergency makeup emergency 
Tylenol for like headaches or if you know someone's like hey you know I have a headache do you have a Tylenol um, I'm glad that I have my Tylenol for myself and for them but this is also I love this little case um, I have in here both Tylenol and Excedrin yeah because sometimes you need Tylenol sometimes you need Excedrin so I just always make sure these are filled with those two okay so I have motion sickness <laughs> And sometimes I go into car, you know, sometimes I'm in situations where my motion sickness flares up. Like I either have to be in the back seat or even in the front seat I get motion sickness. So I always have my Dramamine with me. Um, this is all day less drowsy Dramamine. So I always have this here. One pill does it for me and I'm good for the whole day. Um, what else? Oh my gosh. I have two of these. I just realized that. Maybe I should just get rid of one. I don't need two of these. I'm gonna put in what's in here. There we go. Just join them. All you gotta do, just join them. All right. Throw that out. Just keep one. I only need one. another makeup emergency. Is a black eyeliner because sometimes you go from like a you know very casual event to like a fancy event all of a sudden, and you're like, okay, my makeup needs to like go up a notch. What do I do after I powder? Just. Put on some eyeliner, do a little wink cat eye, and you are good to go. <laughs> I have you, of course, you can't do any of that without a mirror. So I have a little mirror here that has my name on it. It's engraved with my name. And you have like a magnified mirror and then like a regular mirror. Lip balm. Oh my word. I have two of these. I didn't know I had two of these. So I'm a big fan of the Vaseline lip therapy lip balm things. These things are so good. So I have this one in cocoa butter, and this one has a hint of color. It's called Rosy Lips for soft pink lips. And these things are so moisturizing. And look at the bottle. They're so stinking cute. So I usually just have one. I have two here. So I'm going to have to pick and choose. Maybe I'll just keep this one. What else? Okay, so here's another emergency. This is an emergency, okay? And this is a an eyebrow pencil. Why is this an emergency? I fill in my eyebrows. And there has been times where I didn't have this. That for some reason, I didn't set my eyebrows properly. And one of my kids or I myself would just go like this and would completely wipe out half my eyebrow. What do you do when you have one and a half eyebrows? I mean, like in those situations, I would have to just go home because I can't go around with like an eyebrow and a half can't do that so I learned pretty quickly that I'm like hey why don't you just get an extra eyebrow pencil and put it in your bag just in case that happens again you're like boom I got it let's do this come on let's go let's fill them in so for me that would be a very horrible situation so that's why I'm prepared <laughs> Ooh. I have a tide to go because you never know when you're eating something and you spill it on your shirt and you don't have another shirt I mean if I could fit another shirt in here I would but we can't do that. So, tied to go. This has been here for a while. You can tell because it's like fading. I should probably get another one. Anyways, good stuff to have in your bag. I also have, in case, you know what I'm saying, I put on my powder, I put on my eyebrow, I put on my cut eyeliner, and um, maybe just like a lip balm is not enough and I want some actual color in my lips. So I have this little sample that I got from NARS. This is the color Bound. Beautiful color. And look how small it is, right? It like fits perfectly in my bag band-aids guys i'm a nurse so people know that and if they cut themselves they're like where's the nurse where the nurse you got band-aids you got band-aids and also because i have kids and they like cut themselves all the time like okay so um i'm prepared i have my band-aids i have two i usually have like four or five but i need to like restock so this next item is kind of embarrassing but i'm gonna be real i'm gonna be real with you guys okay so some i have certain issues with like my tummy right where i produce more gas than i should Sorry guys, I'm being real, again, I'm being real. So I have these Gas X with me. So whenever you go out and like you eat something, you're like, hmm, yeah, that didn't sit well. Um, and um, yeah, so that's when these guys come to the rescue. This is Gas X and you can tell that I've already used a few and I have four left. So I should think about restocking these. Next thing I have is my adapter. I have a business um, where I could be just selling stuff on the go and like people are like, hey, just charge me or whatever. So I have my square and I have my adapter for my iPhone so I'm able to swipe and sell t-shirts on the go wherever I go. I got no excuse. <laughs> I have a lighter. I don't smoke, guys. No. But I have a lighter because you never know if you find yourself in a situation where you need a fire. Okay, you need, I don't know, I'm stuck in the woods somewhere and like we need like fire or you're in a birthday party and they forgot the matches who has this, who has a lighter right here so it fits in the bag so it's staying there just in case you never know you never know 
All right, if you ever stranded in like the jungle or like the woods, you want to be stranded with me because I got you. Nail clippers, oh my word, I would totally, there has been so many times where I've like chipped a nail, right? Oh my gosh, I usually have a nail file here. I don't have a nail filer, oh my goodness. This is good because now I know what I need to restock and what I need to add, okay? So I hate it when like I'm going through life um, and I chip a nail and I'm like, man, like I totally should file it down or should just cut it or something. What I got? Nail clippers, guys, right here. Or you need to cut through something. Nail clippers. I got a cough drop, you know. So whenever I'm sick or I got to, you know, talk or something and I need to <clears throat> clear up my throat, right here. I got one. I got to restock this one. Yes, yeah, so here I got some hair stuff. Um, yeah, I feel like sometimes, you know, living in South Florida might get a little hot and you need like a scrunchie or something. I got two scrunchies over here. Things to put my hair up. And also if I even have, if sometimes I have like a loose hair or I do like a nice little bun and I have like a piece of hair sticking out. I got two bobby pins. And also to be able to like, I don't know, for handcuffs, just in case you're like, get kidnapped or something. You got hairpins to be able to like, get yourself out of the handcuffs. I don't know how to do that, but at least I have the tools to do it. See, I'm very prepared. All right, I also have a pen with me just because, yeah, you, sometimes you gotta sign stuff, sometimes you gotta fill things out, and I think it's easier for you to find like a napkin or something to write on, um, but then you don't have a pen, right? It's, it's harder to find a pen, so I always have a pen with me in this bag just in case. And last but not least is a pair of scissors. Um, yeah, I feel like there's times, hold on, I gotta sneeze. Whew, excuse me, I think I'm getting sick or something. Anyways. Um, there has been so many situations where I don't know, I'm either at a baby shower or somewhere where I'm like, I need to cut this or, you know what I'm saying, where you need to be able to cut through something and you don't have scissors, but look how small these things are. You get these at the store. Um, and they're very sharp, so you can be very effective in your cutting, but yeah, you just never know when you need them or you need to defend yourself and you got a pair of scissors. Um, so yeah, I got a pair of scissors. Right. Let me put all this stuff back in my little bag. So one thing that I forgot to mention to you guys that I usually have in there, but I took it out, well, my daughter took it out because she needed it, was a hand sanitizer. I always have a hand sanitizer in this. I'm going to put it in here because it totally fits in here. Um, but you should always have a hand sanitizer on you just because, like, girl, guys, germs are just everywhere and they're nasty. And I have kids. I do not want them getting sick. So it's super important, especially if you have kids, when you're going to go eat at a restaurant or you go into a bathroom and there's no soap. Right here, right here. This would totally do it. So yeah, guys, so again, all the stuff that I just mentioned fit in this little pouch. So this is my go-to little pouch whenever I switch purses. I make sure I grab this, my phone, and obviously my cell phone, but that would probably just go like behind my pocket or something. And as long as this purse, the purse that I have fits all this stuff, I am good to go. And this is not very heavy. All these things are pretty, you know, small. Um, and this is perfect. So I'm on the go. I am prepared in any situation, makeup emergency, uh, in the middle of a jungle emergency, nail emergency, <laughs> eyebrow emergency, all of that. We are good. Headache emergency, motion sickness emergency, shopping emergency. Anyways, selling emergency. I'll stop. <laughs> I am good to go because I got that stuff. I would love to know anything else that I should add to um, to my little purse pouch I'm a jigger um if there anything if there's anything you recommend for me to add to it that's essential let me know I already know I have to add my nail filer so that's one thing that I already have to add but what do you guys have in your purse what are you like your essentials in your purse I just hate having a purse where like things are thrown it's disorganized receipts things that you don't really use and things that really you do need you don't have you know like you're like oh my goodness I broke my nail where's my nail filer oh I have to wait till I get home um or like my lips are chapped I need chapstick you know all that fits in your little pouch so that's why i recommend you guys doing that get a little pouch that's like small enough to fit your purse put all that junk in there uh, but again what are your essentials what are things that you guys um have to have in your purse and like do you guys are, are you guys like me where you can um, or you don't want a big purse and a small little purse like this does it for you um yeah i want to hear from you guys and just like what you guys do for your purse situation <laughs> um yes i feel like this is something that like nobody really talked to me about i figured out on my by myself and it's pretty practical right like i think it's pretty practical because if not you'll throw everything in your purse and that's why purses get to be so big and so heavy because you put stuff in there you don't really need um so yes i mean i know i'm kind of being funny with things that i'm showing you but honestly i feel like this is this helps me in my life to be more organized um, and these are just tips and hacks and things that I want to share with you guys and make my life just easier and more organized and just 
better overall. So again, I want to hear from you. And yeah, those are my questions. What are your go-to items that need to be in your purse? What kind of purse do you have and why? Um, and what recommend like what recommendations do you have for me to add to my little purse pouch thingamajigger, okay? All right, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully, hopefully it was helpful to you um, and you guys can use it. Let me know if you guys do add a few of these things. And if you guys don't have that routine, if you guys go ahead, you know, if you guys do it or decide to do it because of this video and all that. All right. Have an amazing day and I will see you guys uh, in the next video. Bye.